Pyramid Lake, and this is why they named it Pyramid Lake. It's an Indian reservation. Oh, hot springs. I thought it was smoke. It's closed, though. Rock that that steam is building right now, it's the same size as I've seen it, say, 50 years ago for the first time. Oh, yeah. It hasn't gotten any bigger. Because <laughs> you're talking, for these rocks to get that big, tens of thousands of years. Right. Just a very slow process. So, but anyhow, that's what we're looking for is that rod to pop up on any of these downriggers. Once they do get to that rod, leave the rod in the holder and start cranking right here. Um, you want to tighten the drag first, all right? Not on this one. This oh, one's good one? to go. Okay. And pretty soon, this one's going to be good to go get And anyhow, leave it in there. Once we know we got the fish on, then take the rod out because if the fish moves, like this one here or that one, if they it's going to cross be able everything. To move with it. Yeah. So as soon as we know we got them, take that rod out and just don't ever give me any slack because we're using barbless. 70. That's what I've set for its max depth. Uh, this one over here is going to continue down to 80. And this one's already at its max depth of 45. All right, that's... That's it, really. Now I just hurry up and wait. <laughs> <laughs> Call fishing. That's a little one. Yeah. That's yeah, not too bad. Yeah. Come here, fish. Kind of skinny. Did you want to keep something like that? No. You gonna get a picture? Yeah, you got it. Got him? Did you get him? You uh, reel all right with that right hand? It's a little tougher, but that's all right. Well, uh, I, the only reason it's on the right is because I had a guy that could not reel with his left. <laughs> so I'm used to all, I've, if even my conventional, I've turned all, everything over to, uh, to the left side. Reel that all the way up to the top. Well, hell, that one's on the right, too. Well, let me switch it over real quick. Yeah, we'll just switch it over. Yeah, I had that old boy that he could, I can't reel with my lap. All right, well, let's switch it over. And then he turns it upside down and tries to reel it the other way. <laughs> and damn near takes the handle off before I caught him. Oh, oh my God. That's so funny when I see people do that. And then you're like, what the hell are you yeah, doing? Yeah. Get the next one. It's best, best. Back up, back up, right? Back up, back up. Bring him to the right, right? There you go. Right there. Woo! 
That's the marvelous part. <laughs> <laughs> Picture, picture, but I'll send you one after. Just, yeah, I'm filming so I can. I got it. That's a nice one. Okay, uh, let's see. Don't, if you can't bring them over, let's take them this way. Put this on the other side of the boat. Yep. Oh, maybe let's get them right here. Yeah, baby. Uh, watch that boom. This guy looks like he's too big to keep. Now, why in the hell was it that just Yeah. Look at that. That was funny for it. Yeah. I just take it up. This is a nice man. Nope, 20, 21 and a quarter. I mean, I. Pretty. That, that, that's the spawning. That shorter than the one I had? Uh, I can't remember. Uh, you want to hold him? And then toss him. I'll, I'll be able to take a picture and send it to you off of this. Yeah. Get rid of him. Go ahead and throw him back. They feed down, you got to reel for a while. It's a lot nicer when they're not getting tossed around. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's off the right. It's not too big. Uh, no, actually, he's getting a little bit bigger as he gets closer. <laughs> oh, there he is. That's how uh, it works, Dad. <laughs> okay, if you can bring him on your side of the boat, that'll work. Come on, fish hand. Or... Fish too. Hooks out again. <laughs> uh, yep, 19 and a quarter. He's a keeper if you want him. Ooh, yeah. Okay. All the salad.
down a little bit. Do me a favor. Uh, did you get that controller on the seat? And at the very bottom. Yeah, see the right, take a right turn. Yeah, hit that one. Keep going, keep going. Okay, let up. Now hit the top left. Top left. There you go. Okay, leave it go. I'm trying to get that fish away from us. Yeah, it's a good fish. See him? No, but I can feel the rod. Yeah. Yeah, okay. See him? Uh, yep, yep, it's a good fish. Brian. Yeah, right. That was supposed to be your fish. Alright. Yeah, he's 25, 25 and three quarters. Tw almost six, 26 and a half, but we gotta measure here. He's legal though. Another one. That's okay, another pile of pee. Okay, boy, yeah. Can I get a picture with him yeah. real quick? Brian, you got your camera? Yep. Their angle so it looks even bigger, right? <laughs> yeah. You got the sun on him? Maybe yes. you maybe you should come out. There you go. That might be the setup. Yeah, definitely love it. There you go. Sweet. Yep. Now ah. ah, you put that one on the internet. That one's worth putting on. Yep. Hell yeah. Woo! Thank you, Gary. Thank you, George. <laughs> Thank you, Brian, for walking away from the rod. Yeah, it did. What did I say this thing was? 25 and 3 quarters. 25 and 3 quarters. So almost 26. That fish could be almost 70 pounds. Yeah. More. That's my eighth fish over 24 inches since October 1st. So we're almost the end of October. Yeah. Last year I ended up with 70 fish over 24 wow. inches. Oh man, look at that thing, man. Woo! <laughs> Check that out, man. Yeah, that grim in his bed. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. That's a great fish. Hell yeah, we'll take that. We'll get to it. I'll smoke that guy. I'll put him in my smoker, the big ones. It's just like salmon. Thank you, Gary. That was what we came here for. It, right? it's my bucket minute. list. Yeah. yeah, I'm curious too. Yeah, it's uh, it's gotta be it's bigger than seven pounds, I think. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's gonna be close. I got this thing at about seven and a half. Yeah, which is pretty close given the given the way this fish looks. He's in good shape. And he's almost 26 inches, 26 and a half. So yeah, call him seven and a half pounds. Seven and a half pounds. Woo! You can call him whatever by the time you get yep. home. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe a 20 pounder. Yeah. Yeah. 
Uh, let's see here. Hey, I've only been watching him on Facebook for just a few weeks. Yeah. And uh, the last 10 fish he's had at about the same time, all 10 of them put together. <laughs> yeah. Actually, actually, probably wouldn't even weigh that much. <laughs> I don't know, they're all more than a pound though, because they're, they're, they're like 18 to 23 inch stripers. So they're about a pound and a half, two pounds. Some of those look like they're, they're, uh, That's because they're, they're, they're next to me. They're next to me. I won't say what I was going to say. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to say something about it. Yeah, well, that's why it looks so small. It's so big next to me. Then we all start measuring dicks and stuff. Do me a favor, grab this rope. Here we go again. get kind of a big head on them hard to grip sometimes so just put it underneath there and don't pull it but there you go okay yeah just put it right over there Search Pyramid Lake hyphen cutthroat charters. Okay. And then you'll pull it. Okay, cool. Alrighty, guys. Gary? Gary, you first. Good visual, yeah. George, thanks, and I'll send that to you. Yeah, send it to me, and I'll and, get uh, it up on there. We'll uh, probably book for May if you have anything open in May. Uh, Give me a call because I'm booking that now. So. Yeah. Okay, as soon as we get All right. back to the hotel, look at the schedule and stuff. Yeah, just give me a date, and then I'll give me a call, and I'll let you know All if right. we have it or not. Okay. Okay. All right, thanks, buddy. Hey, we'll see ya. <clears throat>